Indiana are already casting their ballots and there have been some pretty long lines of polling places, especially earlier on as people wanted to make their voices heard by casting their votes. One of the races they're weighing in on is the race for Indiana governor. Now, if you're still undecided on that race, the three candidates will be making their case to you over the next couple weeks. There's going to be a public debate this Tuesday, October 20th at 7 o'clock on Indiana Public Media. You hear from current Governor Eric Holcomb, who's running for re-election, as well as Democratic challenger Dr. Woody Myers and Libertarian challenger Donald Rainwater. So we have a quick bio on each of them for you. We'll start with current Governor Eric Holcomb. He's a Republican and was elected as governor in 2016, so he's just finishing out his first term. Before becoming governor, he served as lieutenant governor of Indiana and is a Navy veteran. In this week's debate, we'll be watching for him to defend his approach to phased reopening during COVID since he's been criticized by some Democrats who think he's moved too quickly. We're at the end of the first three weeks of stage five, and I've made the decision to continue it. We have countless examples of people who have um, adjusted uh, the way that they do business or hold events or, or gather, and they're proving it can be done responsibly. Next is Dr. Woody Myers running on the Democratic ticket. He's the former state health commissioner. He's a doctor and he's listed COVID-19 response as one of his key issues in the election for months. So this week he told our sister station in Indianapolis that he thinks Governor Holcomb has advanced too quickly in the reopening process. We've got to change our ways. Uh, if we keep doing what we're doing, we're going to keep getting what we're getting and the results are bad. But we have to increase our social distancing. We have to reduce the size of uh, any group that's congregating. Finally, Donald Rainwater is running as a libertarian. Like Governor Holcomb, he's a Navy veteran as well, and he spent his career after working in software development and teaching technology. Like Myers, he has criticized Governor Holcomb's response to COVID as well. But unlike Myers, Rainwater says the state has gone too far in mandating responses to the pandemic. He says he believes COVID-19 is a real virus and has actually had a family member die from it, but he still doesn't believe it's the state's role to force safety measures. I would never, as governor, mandate uh, business closures, uh, people staying at, in their homes for a period of time, uh, masks, uh, vaccines for that matter. I believe those are all personal choices. Now, a reminder, early voting is already underway in Indiana, and if you plan to vote by mail, you have until midnight Thursday to request your absentee ballot from the state. So if you need help finding that, you can text the word ballot to 502-582-7290. We'll send you a link to everything else you need.